sound like on that part? Baby face. That mother TC T on Christian. There, I said it. I said it. TC T on Christian. Who asked you to slay? This album is every. I'm telling you, he hit a motherfucking baby face, bitch. Did you hear that shit? Did you hear that? He hit a baby face. Oh, TC. Oh, I'm not gonna even. Y'all, what's going This is 50 Shades of Feel. Oh my God. I'm, I'm going off. Oh my God. TC, I cannot believe it. It's been, it's been years in the making. I'm gonna tell y'all. TC, Tion Christian. If you all don't know who TC is, Google him. He has time. He had timeless projects, guys. He's done mixtapes. He has EPs. He did a Christmas EP. He had one of my favorite Christmas songs, which is called "Mine." I love that song. Uh, it came out a couple of years ago, and I've been stuck on it ever since. It's one of my favorite Christmas songs. Okay, I, I, I get into it. But guys, he finally has his studio. Uh, his his first album, guys, is called "Rain." It is a 11 track album, guys, that I'm stuck on, and I'm telling you, I'm late. And he's killing, he gonna kill me because I should have been uh, reviewed this and I should have been had heard this album because we talk on Instagram. We actually friends on Instagram. He knows I'm a, a huge fan of him. Now, if you all don't know uh, a little bit back history about TC, he has, uh, he's a, he's a two-time Grammy nominated songwriter. He has written songs from our, our beloved, our beloved music sisters, Okay. My my favorite artist, y'all know, Brandy. He has written for Brandy. He has written for Tamar. He has written for Keisha Cole. He has written for some of the Braxtons, I believe. He has written for. Oh my God, I, I, I'm trying to think. He's written for a lot of a lot of people, and he's a two time Grammy nominated uh, songwriter. Yes, guys, he has done. A lot, okay, in his years and uh, the come up, but he's also a singer. Now, if I had to compare him to an artist, I would probably say he's a little, a lot similar to Brandy, you know, uh, and because him and Brandy kind of have that same, you know, he's a huge Brandy fan like, as well as I'm a huge Brandy fan. Uh, and we all, we, we know Brandy, she, she, she comes with the run, she comes with the melody, she comes with everything, y'all. But long story short, uh, TC is, a, to me, a little bit similar to Brandy, as far as vocalist, he is a great singer. Okay, uh, probably the most underrated. Okay, a lot of people don't know who he is, but I know of him. You know, I've, I've listened to his music. I know his music, but his first his album is finally out. I'm glad it came out in June, and it, I, I I just love this project. I'm stuck. Okay. So, uh, the first, the song that I heard is called, is Sadding. So, when he hit that baby face, okay, I, 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 I can't get off that part for some reason. <laughs> but yes, guys, we got the intro of the project. So many dreams and all you did was lie. Y'all know I was in the process of moving. 
So this is the reason why I'm so late. I did not know he came out with a pro uh, album. Like I'm really, really just shocked that I missed his album. I should have been did this shit. But yes, guys, bigger than love. I really got into the song. Let me get on topic, bitch. Is there something in this wine? Mm. I'm getting off topic. But yes, bigger than love is everything. Okay, I really, really got into the song. I really, really got into just the melodies. I really got into just the mood of the music. It's dance. It's summer. It's hot. Y'all know it was a hot summer this year, and I really, really got into a Bigger Than Love. Then we got the next song, which is one of my favorite songs. That that song was kind of like the first part uh, of Skin Deep, Skin Deep, bitch. Get into this vibe, bitch. Bitch. <laughs> Into this the vibe. This is my favorite. This is one of my favorites. When I heard this song, I said, bitch, no, he didn't. I was out my seat and I really, really got into this song. Like, it's such a summer vibe to it, but it's a bop, y'all. It, 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 it's gonna be played nonstop. I'm telling you, this album's gonna be played nonstop. TC, this album's gonna be played nonstop, bruh. Okay, you got bops on here. This whole album is a bop. I really, really got into Skin Deep. The next song I think is Say It Ain't So. When he hit that baby face on this song, when he, oh, I'm telling you, this is one of my favorites. It's just the, please don't tell me I've been playing a fool over you. Say it ain't so, say it ain't so. Say it ain't so. I, I'm telling you, it's just something about it. It's catchy. I really got into the mood of the music. It has a baby face. It has. It just gave me baby face vibes. It gave me a 90s uh, type of vibe about it, too, which is what I like about the song as well. I really, really got into Say, say It Ain't So. It's everything. Suffocated Lives. Get into it. been through these situations where people can suffocate you with lies okay uh, uh and, and, and that's what happens a lot in, in better broken relationships you know uh you you can't keep suffocating me with your bullshit and that's what he's saying and i really really got into suffocating lies and that's something that has missed me If TC doesn't get noticed from this project, I'm telling you, he has fans. And I'm going to tell you this, because this boy is bringing back real r and B. I'm telling you, he is a kick-ass lyricist. I mean, he, he's a kick-ass writer. I mean, I'm telling you, his mind, he's, he's, he's brilliant. And I really, really get into his, 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 his thought process when it comes to a Miss Me, I'm telling you, I'm telling you, I, I love it. I love it. I really got into the song. It's a great R&B song. We had the Rain Interlude feature on Tawanda Braxton. Now, uh, we got into that part. Then we get into Rain, which is the self-titled song of the album, guys, which is probably a, a bop. I'm telling you, I'm telling you, it, it's, it's, it's everything. Not 
hear R&B like this no more. This is real music. This is the type of music that they used to play back then in the early 2000s, late 90s. I'm telling you, this is what R&B needs. TC, you are... You did the damn thing, bro. I, I love it. Rain. I'm just telling you, I really got into it. It kind of had that Usher uh, vibe. I had an Usher vibe about it that I really liked. It, it's just, you know, it's just classic. It's just something classic about it, and I like it. The next song today is Good Enough. Okay? I'm telling you. Just to stay the same. The last cost you so much pain. I'm telling you, this gave me a Mario vibe slash Lloyd slash um, uh, 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 my boy Jay Holiday. I'm telling you, this had all that in this one song. I'm telling you, when I listened to it, I said the nostalgia of the, the, the sound of the music and just the, the word, the lyrics of the song, the words to the music. Everything about it just really, really brought me back to just when the, everything was good before COVID. You know, uh, and and a uh, BC, it brought me BC, and I really, really got into this project. Like TC, you did amazing. Like the production of it is amazing. The music sounds good. Your vocals are on point. Like everything is just on point. Good enough. Then we get to my favorite song on this album, bitch. Halfway out. Get into it. Get into it. Get into it. Get into it. Piano, come on, bitch. It's over. I'm telling you. I, I, I'm telling you. I, I, this is just that music that I miss so much. This back and forth ain't getting no. Uh, uh, I'm gonna be stuck. I'm gonna be stuck because when it gets to the when it gets to the chorus, it's the best part. I'm telling you, this is one of the best R&B albums so far, as far as male R&B albums this year. Apart from Trey Songs and apart from uh, a few other people, this is probably one of my favorite albums of the year as far as male R&B. I'm sorry. Y'all know, I said Brandy's album is, is, is as far as female. She, she's number one. But uh, I, I'm going to have to give it to TC with the males because... This is the type of music you do not hear anymore. This is the type of music that has been missed in R&B for years. This is the type of music, I'm telling you, did this halfway out the door. I'm telling, I'm telling, I'm stuck. I'm stuck. I'm telling, I'm telling, I'm stuck. This is another song that kind of gave me Jay Holiday. I'm telling you that halfway out the door, halfway out the door. That's the part that reminds me of Jay Holiday. But then that I be that that I'm telling you, I love it. I'm telling you, y'all gotta pay attention to this shit. Then we get to the last song of the album. I gotta keep moving. The last song of the album is I'm a beat. Okay. This is when he kind of get a little turn up. <laughs> I'm 
type of that, that's one of those type of club joints uh, that that you can listen to in the club. But y'all, I'm telling you, I'm telling you, if you if I introduce you to some to 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 to, to some real shit, it's gonna be T T C because uh, he's he's amazing. I'm telling y'all, I've been following him for years, and I'm glad that he finally his he finally is. You know, seeing the light of his album, and you know, because he's had other projects before, and um, he's done a cover, he's done a cover project, and things like that. And he's done cover stuff, but y'all, I'm telling you, he's an amazing artist. Um, and you know, uh, check him out, TC Tion Christian. If you see this review, I gotta give you a clap, bravo, because. This is the type of music that I've been missing and been needing for years and years and years. You know, uh, and, and you know, he, he talks a lot about heartbreak. He talks a lot about being in love. He talks about everything. He puts everything on the table as far as uh, this album goes. It's called Rain. And I love it. I love it. It's the perfect title. It's the perfect album cover. TCT on Christian, y'all. Check them out. It's on iTunes. It's on Spotify. Yes, guys. Uh, uh, um... This album's gonna be on repeat non-stop. This is your boy Fifty Shades of Feel.